Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm Peter. Question. Does FX liners wear down over time and should you consider a replacement liner at some point? Due to a future project that I have with my FX Pantera, I just happened to get a brand new 700 mm 177 heavy liner and I thought why not compare it to the one that I've been using so far in my FX Impact M3. When I receive a new liner I always make sure to clean it properly before I start shooting. I do this by pulling a string with a piece of fabric on it through with some ballistol a number of times. And after that I replace the fabric with a clean one and pull it through until there's nothing left of the ballistol. With the liner cleaned up and ready to go, it's time to start testing. The first thing uh, that I wanted to do was to push a slug through uh, each barrel, the old one and the new one, and see if I could tell some kind of difference from the markings on the slugs. As you can see here, uh, the one on the left is from the new one and the one on the right is from the old one. And it seems like the markings on the new one uh, is a bit deeper than they are on the old one. So from doing this, it seems like there is a bit of a difference between the two liners. The next test I did started with the old liner. I shot 8 shots with an average velocity of 963 feet per second. And after that I replaced the liner with the new one and shot this one also an 8 shot string but with an average velocity of 957 feet per second. So also with this test it shows that there is a slight difference between the two liners. I actually shot a 15 shot string as well that you can see here. And it was roughly the same as the first test with the new liner. It had an average velocity of 956 feet per second. What I want to mention just before we start shooting here at 100 meters is that my old liner has shot perhaps 30,000 shots and if it's more or less I couldn't really tell because I've just shot a lot of shots. But anyway, that was the first part of the test so now let's go into the accuracy testing. Sad but true. Yes, as you could see, it's a couple of days later. Last time I was in the forest, uh, I had a very long and uh, frustrating session because I didn't find uh, any accuracy at all. But when I got back home, it turned out that I had forgotten to uh, tighten up the jam nut that holds the liner. So that uh, kind of explains it all. So now the, the jam nut has been tightened up and uh, the, the liner has shot a few more shots, so I think it's around uh, 500 shots uh, now, so uh, it has been uh, probably uh, broken in. So from here uh, I'll shoot a normal session uh, that I would normally do here at uh, 100 meters, and uh, after that I'll show you uh, some of the groups and make a conclusion. Beautiful group.
that was the end of the session for today and the group that you just saw me shooting was this 1.9 centimeter group here at uh, 100 meters. The conditions were not all that great today as you can probably both see and hear because uh, there's uh, quite a lot of wind here but anyway I managed to push in uh, these groups as well. There are groups of the one that you just saw me shooting at 1.9 then there's one at 2.3, 2.7, 2.8, 2.9, 3, and 3.1 centimeter. And then of course there's this bastard group here uh, at uh, 3.4 centimeters. But anyway, I would say uh, pretty good results in these conditions. So if I'm to compare the new liner with the old liner, uh, I would say that shooting under the same conditions, um, it will probably perform uh, the same. So to uh, jump right into a conclusion and answer the question that I asked in the beginning of the video, do you need to uh, change your liner at some point because it has been worn down after a lot of shots? No, I don't really see the reason for that because my old liner has shot maybe 30,000 shots and it's still performing extremely well. I would actually say that it's performing better now than it ever has has done before. So no, no need to uh, to be afraid that your FX liner will wear down. One thing that I do want to add here at the, the end of the video is that I seem to remember that uh, after getting my old liner, it seemed like the accuracy was getting better uh, over the first uh, over the first month perhaps so maybe after having shot a thousand or 1500 shot the um, the accuracy of this liner might uh, get even better than it is right now so maybe it will even surpass the old liner who knows but anyway that's the conclusion no need to worry at least if you've shot 30,000 shots so just keep on shooting and have fun with your heavy liner and that's all about what I had to say, so until next time, take care and shoot safe.